Well, the soggy summer means some indoor activities are striking gold. Families with time to spare are finding other ways to have fun. Our Eichmann David heads to Colchester, where business has been anything but a gutter ball. A soggy summer outside means a booming business this summer inside. Cindy Mungin says spending the day with her granddaughter at the bowling alley and anywhere else indoors has been a theme this summer. Definitely more indoor um, and basically just playing games in the camper. At spare time in Colchester, a soggy summer hasn't been a downer. Oh, it's been great for business. Summer is normally the quiet season, but instead the pins are being knocked down. We're looking at the weather a week out, two, three days out, and even the morning of to see if we can get some extra people to come in and help. It's not just the bowling lanes that are full, it's been the arcade too. <laughs> Whenever it rains, everybody wants to look finding something indoors to do. But outdoor activities for the family have been harder to come by this summer. I think it has been quite the rainy, cloudy summer. And to come out and experience the sun while we have it for as long as we can is basically our, our mission. Peter Burton brought his family to the Essex Family Fun Center. With mini golf, a driving range, and batting cages, the Family Fun Center says despite the rain, it's been a good summer. People don't mind playing mini golf in the rain. As soon as the showers quit, people are driving in the driveway. But the rain has hindered the driving range. Muddy grass means the balls are getting stuck and making it challenging to pick up. There are probably balls in there that we won't see again for years. Uh, they've just totally went underground. Back at spare time, they're getting ready to roll into the official busy season as everyone else is hoping for some more sun. We made the most of the summer. That's all you can do. In Colchester, Ike Ben David, Channel 3 News.